Lukashenko wanted to send troops to Ukraine, but the army refused. President of Belarus, Alexander Lukashenko, was going to order the invasion of Ukraine in December 2022. On the air of Espresso, the representative of the Joint Transitional Cabinet for Defense and National Security of Democratic Belarus and the founder of the Belarusian Airborne Assault Group within the armed forces of Ukraine, Valery Sakashik, said that the army refused to conduct military operations on the territory of Ukraine. As of the end of December, all combat-ready formations of the Belarusian army were on the border. The servicemen began to move from below, began to ask a large number of questions to the command why they should go to Ukraine, why did the Ukrainian people suddenly become our enemy. The Ministry of Defense tried to intimidate the military, nothing, it didn't work out. The KGB, almost in its entirety, spent almost a week with the troops, blackmailing, frightening, talking with the military, it did nothing. They reported to the top leadership that the Belarusian army was not ready to conduct hostilities in Ukraine, so the order was not given, he said. Belarus has been helping the Russians since the first days of the full-scale invasion. In particular, Minsk gave the Russians territory to attack Ukraine and airspace for missile attacks. Recently, it became known that the leadership of Belarus has limited military cooperation with Russia due to the failures that the occupying troops of the Russian Federation suffered in the east and south of Ukraine.